Okay, what we're going to do in the quick demo video before we get into the install of our light bar is walk you through the various lighting options for your Model 3 truck. Um, I'm going to turn the lights off in a second. We're going to start with just the factory lights that your car comes with out of the factory, obviously. Then we're going to upgrade them to our ultra bright lights. Um, then we're going to add the light bar as well. Um, and I'll also do a quick segment of the light bar with the factory bulbs. So you've got all kind of four options. So I'll just walk through that again. Factory bulbs on their own, ultra bright light bulbs on their own, factory bulbs plus the light bar, and then our ultra bright lights plus the light bar. So with that, I'm going to go turn out the light. So it's pretty dark now in the garage. There's very little ambient light. And so I just pop the trunk. You'll see right now, we've just have the factory bulbs um, in place. You can barely see them because they're awful. Um, and the lux meter is reading around 2.3 lux. So the first thing I'm gonna do is switch out the factory bulbs for ultra bright. Try and do this as quick as I can. Bear in mind that a lux measurement isn't uh, a linear measurement, so you know four lux isn't twice as bright as two lux um, from a visual perspective, from a from what you can recognise as as being bright or brightness. You can tell I'm not a scientist. So just with our ultra bright lights, we get up to 34 and a half lux. Um, so that's pretty good. And then what we're going to do now is um, add the light bar into the equation. Let me just fish around for the wire that I already got up here. Okay, let's take that out. Put that on there. Talk about it. Okay, so this is kind of the, well this is the maximum Flared option of trunk lighting. So we have our ultra bright lights on each side, and then we have the, the uh, light bar across the top of the, the trunk there, or boot. So that gives you almost 390 lux. So um, that's pretty bright, obviously. I think the last option I was gonna do was light bar plus factory lights, just so you can see whether you need to also buy the ultra bright lights. So, let me just switch that one out, put that in. Do the same on this side. Okay, so just with the light bar and the factory lights, we're right around 352 lux. So the light bar itself is a very direct, bright, um, cool light, generates a lot of light. Um, but those are your four options, so it just depends how bright you want your trunk to be. With that, we're gonna jump now to the install video. It's super easy, plug and play, um, takes maybe three or four minutes tops. Okay, so you've seen how bright the different light options are. So now we're gonna go ahead and install the light bar in our Model 3 trunk. Um, just kind of take it out of the box. All right, so hopefully you can see all this. So in the box, you get a couple of adhesive strips, and then you get the light bar itself. Um, and then at this end, I just unravel this. So you have the two, kind of the, the piece that the daisy chains off of the power supply for the, um, the existing front light. So the power from the car will go in here. And then of course the the bulb that's already up there in the in the corner of the trunk will be connected here, and then we also supply power to the to the um, trunk the light bar anyway. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is pop the light out. This is one of our ultra bright lights, um, and we don't have a, there's a retaining clip behind the back of the factory light which you have to pop off if you need to. We show that in one of our other videos, but this will just come out pretty easily. Right now the bulb is off just to make things easier to see on the video. So we're going to remove 
the light. I'm going to plug, and what we what we actually need to do now. So because we're going to be running the um, the light bar towards the back of the um, the trunk, we're going to speed to the top here. Bring it down through here. I'm going to plug that in. Like that. I'm going to plug in the light. Okay, like that. Everything should clip into place. I'm going to just tuck this back up here and then put the light in. So that's all we need to do from the perspective of being over here. And then all we want to do with this is just hide the cable, and the trim. That's great. And we're going to fit it right there, sort of dead center. So we're going to I'm just going to use one one of these strips, but if you want to cover the whole thing, that's obviously fine. Let's just put that on the back of the light bar. Peel that off. Then kind of just center it up here so it's shining down. You can also put it across the top here, it's up to you. Um, this is where I'm going to put this one. And then that's it. I mean, it's as simple as that. So what I'm going to do is quickly close the trunk to reactivate all the lights. All right, now you'll see the trunk light and the two ultra bright lights are all working fantastically. And from the previous segment, you would have seen how bright it is with this combination. So you can combine the trunk bar or the light bar um, with the factory bulbs and with our own bulbs. If you really want to, you can just remove the bulbs from the sides altogether, but there's not really any reason to do that. The more angles of light you have shining into the trunk, the better. Okay, thanks for watching.